in the new position. The first thing I'm going to do is make some bacon patties. So that's been in the fridge for probably about an hour after making the pastry. I'm just going to literally roll it out. Remember that when you're rolling it out, it's got butter in it, so you don't really want to handle it too much. You just want to get it done. And inside here, I've got oxtail stew blitzed up. So, I do some pretty old school, so I'm going to have to catch that in. So you can use a shake cut if you like, or use whatever you've got to hand. I like using a glass. So I'm just making three for now. Just past midnight, he shoots again. Ton I've lightly dusted it, roll it out to the desired shape that you want. I'm going to do little mini ones for now, so just like that. And pretty straightforward, get a bit of a filling. Put it in the middle, put over the top. and then fruit the sides. Right, press it down just so the filling gets close to the edge. The headlights this morning. Brexit trade talks are resuming with the UK's chief negotiator calling on the EU to show more realism. Lord Frost says that progress must be made this week and that the two sides will afford to go and in with well the world shot around. Out. Nevertheless, uh, the sticking points do exist to some of uh, the military. Access to fishing waters. So roll it out. The clock is ticking on Britain's exit from the make this one a little the bit wider. Is freedom from the common fisheries policy. Yeah, a good so Brexit deal could mean more boats on the quay and more fish that's landing. The shape. And I'm gonna put a the bit more in this one. Define the future for the town, the fleet, and, and the fish market. And then right, pull the top over, the over so it touches, press it down a yeah, little bit just to get it to the edges. We're in a bubble because we're safer with each other. Yeah. I think you're in more than a bubble. Um, <laughs> <three. laughs> Selling the fish landed in coves and harbours across the county, Newland Market is the beating heart of Cornwall's fishing industry. But it's a shadow of the place. Another one there. Right, here we go then. Well, I first attended the, 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 the fish final uh, market when I was 17, 17 years old. And going back oh, then, it wasn't refrigerated at all. It was... Um, Obviously, at this time as well, you have your uh, oven on preheated to about 220... Um, well, 195, I would say. That much so that, um, 195, 20, 25 minutes. You'll be able to gauge when it's done from looking, looking at it, when the pastry's cooked. Fish, then. Well, well, the last fish market in Cornwall is also the last in England to operate a shat auction. Each morning, a tight network of local traders bid against each other face to face. Two ten, two pounds forty. You're in. Just looking at those stories. Yeah. Makes it a lot better. So I hope you have fun making this. Basically I use 750 grams of um, plain flour sieved with two tablespoons of turmeric, a tablespoon of curry powder, salt and use the 500 grams of uh, butter and uh, mix it all together, added probably 150 ml of water. If you um, make it into a dough, so wrap it in grease with paper, it's in the fridge for an hour. You, you haven't got to leave it in there for an hour, you can 20 minutes, half an hour or so. Right, I hope you enjoyed that. Remember the kitchen, please. I'm sure it would be strongly denied.